शेतकऱ्यांनी पण ह्याच्यामध्ये फार बारकाईनं सगळ्या तपास करायला सूचना दिलेल्या आहेत आणि मी पण माझ्या परीनं तशा प्रकारच्या सूचना डिपार्टमेंटला दिलेल्या आहेत राजकारण करण्याच्या ठिकाणी जरूर आपण राजकारण करू परंतु आपल्यातलाच एक सहकारी आपण अतिशय म्हणजे त्याचं वय देखील कमी होतं म्हणजे जाण्यासारखं वय पण नव्हतं आणि एकंदरीतच तो इतका सगळ्यांशात मिळून मिसळून असायचा त्याचं वक्तृत्व चांगलं होतं समाजाला तो एक आपलंसं करण्याचं काम करायचा आणि हार उन्हारी तुम्हाला आठवत असेल त्यांच्या स्वतःच्या त्यांनी इफ्तार पार्ट्या ज्या करायचा तर त्याच्यामध्ये सगळ्या आणि त्याच्या सगळ्या क्षेत्रातले सिने इंडस्ट्री असेल तुमची इंडस्ट्री असेल उद्योगधंदे सगळ्या 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 क्षेत्रामध्ये त्याचा अतिशय चांगले संबंध होते मित्रत्वाचे संबंध होते आणि फार म्हणजे मला तर अजूनही विश्वासच बसत नाही की बाबा आपल्यात नाही आहे पण झालंय ते वस्तुस्थिती आहे आणि काळाच्या नियतीच्या पुढे आपलं कुणाचं तुमचं आमचं काही चालत नाही आम्ही संपूर्ण पक्ष आम्ही सगळे सहकारी देशांच्या बरोबर आहोत त्यांच्या कुटुंबियांच्या बरोबर आहोत म्हणजे त्यांच्या परिवाराच्या बरोबर आहोत या अशा पद्धतीनं आता जिशांशी पण बोलत असताना तेच सांगितलं त्याची बहीण पण तिथं होती त्या डॉक्टर आहे आणि त्या पण अतिशय अशा मजबूतीनं त्या कालपासून तिथं उभ्या आहेत पी एमला फक्त पी एम करण्याच्या करता वेळ लागला म्हणून थोडा आता जवळपास इतका उशीर झालेला आहे परंतु आत्ता मी डीनशी पण बोललो डीननी पण सांगितलं दादा अर्ध्या तासामध्ये आता आम्ही तुम्हाला पी एम करून देत कल जो घटना हुई बंबई में वो हमें तो बिल्कुल विश्वास नहीं हो रहा है कि ये घटना हुई है लेकिन हमारा एक नेता बाबा सिद्दीकी ये बहुत सालों से पॉलिटिक्स में काम कर रहे हैं यहाँ बंबई में उन्होंने कॉर्पोरेटर के नाते भी शुरू में काम किया दस साल और उसके बाद कांग्रेस के एक एम के नाते भी उन्होंने नाइन्टी नाइन टू ऐसे तीन टर्म वो चुनाव जीत के आए बहुत अच्छा असेंबली में भी उनका काम था मैंने खुद देखा मिनिस्ट्री में भी वो थे मिनिस्ट्री में भी उनका काम बहुत अच्छा होता था जो भी उनका डिपार्टमेंट है उनके डिपार्टमेंट का पूरा स्टडी करके लोगों को कैसी मदद हो सके इसके बारे में वो ज़्यादा ध्यान देते थे और कल जो बात जो घटना हुई है वो घटना आज तक हमें विश्वास नहीं हो रहा है कि ऐसा कुछ हुआ है लेकिन पुलिस डिपार्टमेंट ने तुरंत उसके बारे में जानकारी शुरू की है दो लोगों को उनके हाथ में लगे हैं दो लोग और और भी कुछ लोग हैं उनको ढूंढने के लिए उनको लाने के लिए पांच टीम पुलिस डिपार्टमेंट ने लगवाई है और अलग अलग स्टेट में उनको भेजा है सीएम साहब भी इसके ऊपर ध्यान उनका ध्यान दे रहे खुद होम मिनिस्टर भी दे रहे हैं और मेरा भी है हमारे बाकी साथियों का भी है और जल्द से जल्द पता चलेगा कि एग्जैक्ट ये सब करने का कारण क्या है किसने ये सब सुपारी दी किसने ये ये सब किया इसके बारे में तुरंत तुरंत नहीं लेकिन एक दो तो दिन में ही पता चलेगा ऐसा मुझे विश्वास है और आज साढ़े आठ बजे बड़ा कब्रस्तान मरीन लाइन्स में जो है वहाँ उनको दफनाया जाएगा सरकारी इतना ने दफनाया जाएगा राजकीय सम्मान से और उसके बारे में भी गवर्नमेंट ऑफ महाराष्ट्र ने ऑर्डर्स निकाले हैं और अभी थोड़ी देर के बाद पोस्टमार्टम होने के बाद उनको उनके घर में लेके जा लेके जाने वाले हैं और वहाँ कुछ टाइम रखने के बाद उनकी जो कॉन्स्टेंस है वहाँ लोगों को दर्शन के लिए रखने वाले और फिर बाद में रात को साढ़े आठ बजे ये सब उनके दफना दफनाने की पूरी ये हो जाएगा दा, दादा अपोजिशन लीडर यहाँ आए थे उन्होंने कहा कि कानून व्यवस्था फेल हो चुकी है अब पूरे महाराष्ट्र में सबको बुलेट प्रूफ जैकेट दे देना चाहिए क्योंकि सरकार और ये सब फेल है इस्तीफा देना ये देखो वो तो बोलेंगे ही बोलेंगे 
ये ऐसे अब बिल्कुल नहीं होना चाहिए था अभी अपोजिशन वालों क्या बोलेंगे वही बोलेंगे लेकिन हमारा काम है कानून ठीक रखना कानून व्यवस्था ठीक न रखना और उसके बारे में और भी जो भी ये हमारे चीफ मिनिस्टर डेप्यूटी चीफ मिनिस्टर कल रात को खुद आए थे उनसे पता चला क्योंकि कल मैं पूना में था मैं सुबह यहाँ पहुँचा लेकिन मेरी रात को देर से देवेंद्र जी के साथ भी बात हुई चीफ मिनिस्टर साहब के साथ भी बात हुई उन्होंने बताया कि इसके पीछे कौन है किसका हाथ है ये हम ढूंढ के ही निकालेंगे हम जरूर उसका बंदोबस्त करने वाले हैं जिन्होंने ये सब कदम उठाया और अपोजिशन वालों को जो भी बोलना है वो बोल सकते हैं लेकिन मेरी इतनी उनको बिनती है कि अपना एक साथी उन्होंने कांग्रेस में भी काम किया हमारे महाविकास आघाड़ी में भी उन्होंने काम किया अभी राष्ट्रवादी कांग्रेस में आके वो महायुति का भी एक घटक बने थे और अच्छी तरह से काम करने की उनकी कोशिश थी वो स्पीच भी अच्छी तरह से देते थे उनके एरिया में कुछ कार्यक्रम भी हुए वहाँ लोगों ने बहुत अच्छी तरह से रिस्पॉन्स दिया था मैं खुद था प्रफुल भाई थे बाबा थे जिशान थे सब हम थे लेकिन जो नहीं होना चाहिए तो हुआ इसका हमें बहुत दुख है All right, that was Maharashtra Deputy CM uh, Ajit Pawar essentially going on to state number one that of course it's an unfortunate and shocking incident. In fact, while speaking on the matter, he has said that the police are investigating the same and uh, two have been arrested in this case. Shweta and Shrishti, my colleagues who have been reporting on this development for us, join me live. Let me straight across, straight away, beg your pardon, go across to Shweta. Um, Shweta, we are, of course, looking at multiple angles in this case. We just heard what the Deputy CM of Maharashtra, Ajit Pawar, also had to state in terms of what we know so far with the legal action. Two have been arrested. One is absconding. Like he said, the reason behind this is yet to be ascertained. But as we look at that, several sources also indicating that there could be a Bishnoi angle. You have, in fact, had the opportunity to also speak uh, while reporting, of course, to the DCP as well. What can you tell us as far as where things stand at the moment and what do we know? Well, Nivedna, that's right. In fact, first of all, let me assure to our viewers that how authentic our input was. Uh, before this time, through our sources, we got to know that at least five to six units from crime branch and other units have been deployed to other states as well. Now, this has been very well confirmed by Deputy Chief Minister Mr. Ajit Pawar while, uh, uh, you know, shortly he was interacting with media. So, this is how uh, the genuine inputs are coming uh, from Mirror now. Uh, while focus Focusing on the investigation part and the legal part, now one must remember a few things that uh, out of three, now uh, two, uh, two accused are being uh, apprehended and one is at large and uh, for that particular purpose, now the crime branch is also in connection with Delhi Intelligence Unit. Uh, Legally, what we understand is that because they were apprehended last night, so as per the procedures, Nivedna, they will be taken out, they will be produced in court. But before getting produced in court, the accused would be taken to medical. So this is the procedure what usually happens. And we are reporting from Nirmalnagar Police Station, as my originalist Manoj Halwai is showing you the presence and the deployment of various units also. There's uh, already, we know crime branch is there. There's also the ATC and the other units of Mumbai Police. Now, remember, when it comes to this high-profile case, what we understand is that several information that has been coming out is yet to be certained by the police officials, like the major one is of the Lawrence Bishnoi gang connection. Now, remember, uh, there is a pattern, Nivedna, that, that has been observed since uh, since a long time. Whenever there is, there is a firing, whenever there is uh, a murder which takes place uh, across India, and if it is uh, done by law, uh, Lawrence Bishnoi gang. It's either Anmol Bishnoi, Lawrence Bishnoi or any of their associates take their responsibility and they publicly announce it. They declare that we take the responsibility of so-and-so happenings. But in this particular case, that has not happened so far. That has actually confused, even made 
the cops or uh, perplex whether this has any kind of connection with the Lawrence Bishnoi gang or not. So they are probing into various angles that has been emerging so far. Remember, uh, between this there was also an angle about the SRA dispute. But uh, keeping that apart, the Lawrence Bishnoi gang angle is something that has been being probed upon uh, with uh, the crime branch. Also, the uh, the kind of help that is getting from the Delhi Intelligence Unit. What we can tell to our viewers currently is that in short time the accused would be produced uh, in court but before that they would be taken to medical. As the day goes by it is anticipated that the Mumbai police would be taking a press conference to shell out the uh, most uh, in, uh, you know the correct information because we have seen this is a kind of high profile case and various news are just emerging out from this particular case. So yes by evening uh, one can anticipate that the Mumbai police would be taking a press conference to share the more details. Back to you. Right, Shweta. In fact, as you help us draw more perspective is what's the latest that we are picking up. Stay with me. I'm going to try coming back to you. But let me also get in a word in from Shrishti. Shrishti, in fact, uh, since morning, you have been reporting from outside Baba Siddiqui's residence where security has also been ramped up. But what we're given to understand in this particular matter, of course, our colleague Shweta was telling us the latest in terms of legality, uh, what we do know. But with sources indicating that Baba Siddiqui had received a threat. This was about 15 days ago and moreover his security was ramped up. Was that the case? What do we know on that front as well? Well, of course, his security was ramped up after he got a threat just 15 days ago, and that's why uh, why security has been given to him. And mm. after that, what comes across is that he was shot dead. And this raises a serious question on, on law and order situation in the state of Maharashtra. Every other opposition party leader is saying the same thing. Also, importantly, if we talk about in, in, if we talk about the investigation, now the accused, two accused who has been nabbed by Mumbai police, they both are from Haryana as well as UP. Now, the Mumbai team has contacted the local police in Haryana as well as UP and they are trying to investigate the residence of these accused as well as if they have any other kind of history over there. Uh, we have got to know that one of the accused is a history cheater and that's how they will be investigating the entire matter. But important Importantly, today the crime branch officials also met Zishan Siddiqui. They have also tried to contact him and uh, dig out more things about the entire threat matter and what exactly uh, happened in last 15 days. Were, uh, what kind of threats were being uh, you know, received by Baba Siddiqui and has he ever mentioned it to Zishan? Those all things will also be investigated. Also, police is investigating on the lines of Lawrence Bishnoi and his involvement in this entire matter. As we all know that uh, there were several threats to Salman Khan also earlier. There were several rounds of firing in front of the Galaxy apartment of Salman Khan just a few months ago. And importantly, when we understand the dynamics of Baba Siddiqui and his connection with Bollywood, we know that he is a good friend with Salman Khan as well as other top Bollywood actors. And that's how is it any kind of, uh, you know, uh, indication towards Salman Khan that also will be investigated? Importantly, in this entire matter, when when police is investigating the Lawrence Bishnoi angle, uh, it has always been there, you know, when whenever there is such kind of firing or probably a killing, uh, the the Lawrence Bishnoi gang themselves takes up the responsibility and their, some or the other associate uh, puts it on social media. But this has not happened now, so police is investigating that matter as well. Uh, what we are also coming to know from our sources is that uh, the special team from Delhi will also be coming to Mumbai and they will also be investigating the entire matter and importantly the state government today has you know uh, announced that the state funeral will be given to Baba Siddiqui so definitely a lot of political developments lot of investigative developments right, is Shishti, going like on. you pointed However, out uh, right that now, the latest I... also with the fact that what we heard Ajit Pawar also say a while ago that he will be uh, given state funeral um, and of course yeah. what we're picking up in terms of all the angles but Shushri and Shweta thank you very much for joining us uh, with that but uh, like the both of them did point out essentially as to how the investigation is panning out let's also tell you on that front that the crime branch is actively investigating two angles that is a property dispute in Bandra like Shweta pointed out and potential ties to the Lawrence Bishnoi gang. Now according to sources two suspects arrested in the killing of the former Maharashtra minister Baba Siddiqui have claimed they belong to the Lawrence Bishnoi gang. Now the cops haven't verified this claim while the gang is yet to admit responsibility for the murder.